Hello YouTube and Preppers. This is the Comms Prepper and I'm wrapping up my trip here at the retreat location. I spent the last three days working on the off-grid solar power upgrade project. I made a lot of progress but didn't get it finished. I was able to get the batteries relocated from the house into the battery box. I put a rain slash heat shield on top of the box with a nice air gap down below so the gases can vent when the battery's charging. The panels are online now. They come together in that combiner box. Come down to the Morningstar TS MPP T60 charge controller, which is now maintaining the batteries for me. I was able to mount the fuses there. I still need to order two more. I came up short. And I installed the temperature relay switch, the 12 volt switch, that runs the cooling fan up here. And up top, if you can see it, that little silver tab there is the actual temperature sensor. So the theory of operation is if the temperature gets too hot inside this box with the charge controller there and the inverter, that controller will kick on that fan, expel the hot air out of the top of the box, pulling in cooler air from the bottom vent down below. So that's pretty much where we stand with the project. Next trip out here, we'll get the rest of this done and we'll call for the electrical inspector. I still need to put some siding on the side of this box but I think we're going to be ready to go with just one more trip out here to the beautiful mountains of West Virginia. And as always, thank you for watching my videos and subscribing to my channel. This has been the Comms Prepper with a, another update on the off-grid solar power upgrade project that's taken almost nine months. Thanks for watching, guys.